$3. And guys, we're going to have to, yeah, we'll, we'll have to move the monitor in just a, ma a matter of moments. But we are going to talk next about our um, Casada. Did I pronounce that correctly? You got it. Yay! Milo passes Yay. the test. Um, in our <laughs> leather top hand satchel, we gave you a little preview of this one a little bit earlier. So 30 already were pre-ordered. Thank you for those of you that pre-ordered. Only 90 remain. Oh, 190 remain. So here's the cream tool, which is gonna be the lightest choice of the three. Only 29 of that. There, there's some reason, and I'm, and I'm not even quite sure why, but there's some reason that I'm gravitating towards that one. Um, I do love this one, which is the floral map. And I think because I love the juxtaposition of the florals with, the, with your traditional map, something that's different. Um, so yes. really cool bag in that one. So it's, we're calling that one floral map. Something fun, if you're already a collector of the maps, um, that's something that you don't probably already own. And then of course, we've got our classic here and what we're calling our, I think we're, this one is gonna be called our gold tooled um, on this one. So this is called gold tooled, which is probably gonna end up being the most popular, wouldn't you say, uh, Patricia? Just because of its well, extraordinary design on this one. Yeah, what's so special about this bag is not just the shape that's new, but these toolings are new. These uh, colors are new. And that floral map with that English garden flowers on it is new. So you're not only getting a new silhouette, but you're seeing a preview of what our fall is going Ooh. to look like. So this is really, really special. You can't see these anywhere else right now. So it's only here and uh, it's, well, it says exclusive. So yeah, this is it. Yeah. This so is exclusive. Our wow. Our floral map is the most popular. So that was the one. Remember when we gave you the preview? I looked at it and I go, oh my gosh, look yes. at that one. Yeah, that doesn't surprise you, does it, that this one is, is no. most popular? Yeah. When I'm looking at it on the screen, I'm just getting goosebumps <laughs> because it looks like, it really looks like the vintage bag you'd find, right? Yes. It looks yes. like that is the bag that I saw in that shop because it's just... It looks like antique-like feel, doesn't it? Those beautiful flowers on top of that map and then the top handle bag and the hardware and the shape of that bag. Ah, I get excited seeing it. You know, sometimes I design these bags like a year and a half ago before they ever got to market because the process is so long. And to see it, you know, after I don't see it after all that time and then to see it on TV like this, I'm just like, oh, and that tooling, that's a new tooling pattern that I developed from doing research of tooling flowers that were from the 40s and 50s. And it was a common flower that design that was used by men and women who tooled leather back in the 40s. So I, I thought, well, let's make a pattern out of it. And it turned out beautiful. You can see how roomy this bag is. You've got so much inside there. And of course it has the pockets on one side, the elastic pockets, and then it's got the, the zip pocket on the other. So it's really roomy. You got a slip pocket in the front, which is, which is fun. That'd be a great place for your phone or keys or whatever. And then on the back, you've got a zip pocket, which usually you don't see top handle satchels that have a secure metal zip pocket and when you put your hand in there again you're going to see how deep it is so again you don't even have to open up that bag to get some of your goodies out of there yeah i also like to sh just want to show the, the bottom of the bag too look at how great that looks even from the bottom so it's just yeah the absolutely shape is, the shape on this is also so terrific um uh, on this bag let me let me offer the measurements on this one and invite you to order it's been very popular um this handbag from top to bottom you're looking at 10 and a quarter inches tall from left to right you're looking at almost eight inches at its widest point at the bottom and then the handle goes up from uh, just from 21 and a half to 24 and a half inches this one is called our gold tooled this is called our beautiful cream tooled and then of course we also have what we're calling our floral map. And the cream tooled only 18 remaining. Don't forget to use our free shipping and handling and flex pay. $60 to be able to get this at home. There's nothing 
better than a new handbag. All the quality of the leather that we've talked about. Let's go to our phone lines because we're gonna go to Alabama and say a quick hello to Sylvia who's joining us. Hi Sylvia, it's Marlo, it's nice to meet you. Hi Marlo, it's nice to meet you. I wanted to speak to Miss Patricia. By all means. Hi, I'm right here, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm good, thank you for calling. Miss Patricia, I have had many of your bags. I've ordered your bags. I've given them as gifts. I, I love all of them. But I have had an idea for a long time, and I just didn't call in to ask you about it. I would mortgage my house if you would make a cape of the leather. Uh, about hip uh. with a hood and uh, lines so it would be warm. Uh, I know it would be expensive because it would take a lot of leather, but that is something that I would love, and I know a lot of people would. Have you ever considered making items like this? Well, you're going to be surprised to hear this. It's not all leather, but we are launching on HSN later this fall. Um, I think probably in October, some knit capes that actually have leather lacing on them throughout them and around the, the edges of them. And so take a look at those when uh, they release those. But all leather, that's an idea, too. That's a great idea, actually. Sylvia, yeah. thank you so much. I'm thrilled that you called and that you were able to offer that great suggestion because quite frankly, Patricia, a lot of our ideas do come directly from our customers. Absolutely. And, you know, I think that the leather has really resonated a lot in, in the women who buy these handbags because you notice right away the difference between my leather and the leather of yes. a lot of brands. And yeah. that's one of the things that just, you, that you become a repeat buyer. And so then you start thinking, oh, I wonder what she could make other things in leather. <laughs> and that's what happened when, with the leather cuffs. You know, it was like, yeah, sure. I could take the same leather and make a beautiful cuff out of it. And, and it's really become popular. So uh, it doesn't surprise me that we get suggestions like that from time to time. And that is a great one. And it would be beautiful. I don't want you to mortgage your house, so please. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think I think that Sylvia really just expressed. Um, she knows that it would make sure. for such a great investment. Sylvia, thank you once yeah. again for being a part of the show. Thank so you. So this brand new bag is on its way to selling out. Brand new, something that you haven't seen before. We have a dozen remaining in the cream, so if you want that one, hop on in. Don't wait for that one. The most popular has been that floral map. You haven't seen that before. We have. 70, 70 of you uh, will be able to grab this bag and it's not available anywhere else right now. It is new and it's exclusive. And that's fun because although we are in millions of homes, the, some of these exclusive pieces are like small capsule collections and I love the collectability when you do that. You can't always do that, I know, Patricia, but there are a few of the bags that you bring to us exclusively at HSN and this floral map design in this particular style is an exclusive choice for everyone. And then, of course, we've got the gold tooled, um, which is also a, a winner. New tooling, as you've said. So even for the for the women that have been purchasing your, your handbags for years, this is going to be something fresh, something new, something different. $180 for this handbag if you'd like to have it. It's called the Casoda. Casada uh, leather bag. Cause... Did I get it right? I, I did. Casoda, You Casada. got it. Yeah. It's been... <laughs> Look, it's it's you all. You say it's, tomato, I say tomato. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, but uh -uh. seven one four five seven one is the item number. Great style on this one. That one still catches my eye. That floral map. There's just something about it that I think is really it great. It is. Yeah, really terrific on that one. Um, but they're all beautiful. And so if if you're ordering, you know that you know your your bags are all little works of art. And you've talked to us about. The painstaking process of being able to curate these 
beautiful leathers and the selection processing and the hand finishing, the hand tooling that's involved with the handbags. And you can see it. I mean, we have such a discerning eye, you know, especially when it comes to handbags that are well made. And I know Joanne spoke about that earlier. Silver spoke, of, Sylvia spoke about that as well. And, you know, for customers who are new and customers that have been with you for a long time, we so appreciate the artistry um, and the quality of the materials that you curate for your handbags. Oh, thank you. It really is a, a labor of love. And, you know, when you put your name on something, at least this is how I feel, I take a lot of responsibility and a lot of pride in that. And I don't want my name on a bag that is, it isn't one, a bag I wouldn't buy my, myself, one that I, I want it to be a great, amazing value to us because that was one of the reasons I started this line too is because I didn't feel like there was a, an amazing quality bag out there at a price that more women could enjoy. And I just thought it was just so disheartening that I had to do it. So you've got great leathers here, great craftsmanship, great memories in some of these super, you know, old vintage inspired bags that we remember from our past. Look at this 